you know, I never thought the burning of someone's body would be so enlightening. Here, yeah. something very whimsical about someone's body burning is just enlightens it. Guys, it is just fire. That's it, all it is. It's not just fire, Victor. It's, it's art. art. Bruh, it's fine. It does look very whimsical a little bit. But you have to thank the ladies for making the bonfire. It is very catastrophic, if you know what I mean. Thank you, my little flower. Mm. Yeah, I gotta say. Well done, ladies. Actually, who are you two, if you don't mind me asking? Well, Price, this is my sister, Lila. And this is my sister. Here, her name is Lady Raven. No, Ghost, it is little... No, no, fuck, it is Natasha. Get it right. Fuck. I was wrong, Victor. You look a little pissed. <laughs> Ow. No. Fuck. Well, it's lovely to meet you ladies. And might I say, Natasha, was it? You look a little beautiful if you... If I say so myself. <laughs> Sorry, tripping over my words a little bit. Listen here, buddy. I already have two people hitting on my sister and making coitus with her. I don't need a third. And besides, you can try the moving on someone else. She is my little sister and I am protective over her. Technically, Victor, she's a main comic. And I'm sorry, but we're the only ones that are protecting her. Now hold up there, ghost. What makes you think you can get all the fun? Hmm? Maybe I want a little bit of it. Price, I appreciate you saving my life and all, but you need to back off. The commander is ours, not yours. So, I suggest you take Ghost's advice and find someone else. Calm down, Koenig. I'm just judging your cock and balls. <laughs> Joshing, sorry. <laughs> I'm a little bit drunk, so. Actually, that begs a question. Victor, what are you drinking? Well... I am a vodka man, but I'll drink anything you guys have on the table. What do you have? Well, you do look a little bit the classy, man. So, I've got some 80-proof scotch. I think that's going to sit you right down. Actually, I think I'll take some of that. Cheers, mates. And comrades. We've come a long way. But you guys know our new general is coming in. You know that, right? Yeah, yeah, I know. I just wonder who it's going to be. Hopefully this one won't be a stick in the mud like the other one. Yeah. I wonder. Maybe they'll get somebody like Morgan Freeman or something. <laughs> well, guys, you you might want to look behind you. He's, He's right behind us, isn't he? he? Well, hi there. I'm Morgan Freeman, your new general. Stand at attention. Yes, yes sir. Pleasure to meet you, sir. At ease, gentlemen. Well, it looks like you guys are having some celebration of some sort. I must say, might I partake? Um, yes, sir. Damn. That's a good brew. So anyway, at ease, gentlemen. Sir, if I might ask you a question, what brings you as our new general? Please, don't call me sir. But I'm here as your new general. And I understand the person you're burning in that bonfire over there was a corrupted piece of shit. Now, if I am corrected, excuse me, this brew is hitting me faster than I thought. If I'm correctly certain that you guys were the ones that took him down, I must say that is a very astute effort that you guys did to take him down. With all due respect, g General, it was Koenig's idea. And then Price had to intervene. Why, well, thank you very much, Victor. But I know goddamn well you guys would not have survived if I didn't intervene. Calm down, Price. We know you did a good job. And you also saved my life, General. Oh, please. You don't have to do all this general formal shit. Just call me Morgan. Uh, yes, uh, General Morgan. Actually, I kind of like that a little better. General Morgan has a ring to it. But anyway, back to why I'm here. I'm here to give you guys a new recruit. Well, a familiar one. I'm so general. You what? <sighs> Damn. That is good. Uh, I'm sorry, General Morgan. You said new, but old recruit.
Ooh, hello there. So, is that you? You son of a bitch, come here. <laughs> <laughs> Good to see you. Uh, Man, got a little scrawny last time I saw you. <laughs> That's what you think. But it's good to see you, Ghost. Koenig, how are you? I'm good, but a little confused. What brings you back to the barracks? Well, Koenig, what brings me back to the barracks is that the fact that, that you guys need a new recruit. So, I'm here. And what I say? Everybody here looks a little bit shocked to see me. I know, hello. Who are these two lovely lasses that are here? These two lovely ladies. Well, how about the two boys tell us about them? Ah, oh, yes. This is my sister, Natasha. He. Maybe he calls her that. But I call her Little Rabbit. It's much more cuter that way. And this is my sister, Lila. Well, hello there. Lovely to meet you, lasses. Uh, what was your name? Natasha, was it? Well, how about I call you, my little bunny lass? Hmm? Hmm, lovely to meet you. But anyway, watch yourself, self. You might be here in the barracks, but you need to realize the little rabbit is mine. Go so relax. Why are you getting so defensive over a little lass? Besides, you can't be the only one that moves in on someone's lady. Am I right? Soap, ghost, enough. You two need to chill. This is a celebration. No time for a petty squabble. Especially over a fine woman like the commander. Well, you know you can't count out my little flower just yet. She is also fine too, you know. Mm. You know what? I'm too drunk for this shit. I'm going back to the barracks. You guys have a good time. Well, it's alright, you know. I could give me a little bit of that pint anyway. So, I'm going to take me a little snaps brew and go take me a nap. And bunny lass... Hope to see you sometime soon, too. The fuck do you say? Oh, me? I didn't say anything, ghost. Nothing for you to worry about. Nothing at all. <laughs>